All right, guys, welcome back to Full Circle with Joyce. I'm here with my next guest. He goes by the name Crazy Kenna uh, of the Content Cartel, and he's a comedian. Karibu sana to the show. It's good to have you here. How are you doing this morning? Ukosawa. Corona, quarantine, nini, nini? As I said, my situation now, I may reduce uh, vitu mingi. Yeah. But uh, all in all, we have to adapt. Yeah. Yeah. Nasi ukona sauti? Sindio mie mtumzima. Ukona biz. My yeah. goodness. Wow. Anyway. All right. So, kwa majina kamili unaitwa nani? Crazy Kenna. Hapana. <laughs> <laughs> Your mom did not name you Crazy Kenna. <laughs> yeah. Oh, kwa majina kamili. Uh -huh. Anaitwa Kennedy. Kennedy? Odhiambo. Kennedy Odhiambo. Yeah. You're actually a student. Yeah, I'm a student at uh, Jomo Kenyatta University. Uh -huh. What yeah. are you studying? I'm a third year student studying actuarial science. Zasa, how, how does an actuarial science student, you know, become so popular doing vines? Because, uh, no offense to actuarial science people, but we don't necessarily look at them as funny people. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he looks so tense. I looks so tense. So, uh, si, si, si kazi ngumu vile, but uh, you know, we have a talent, uh, a gift, uh, but I actually don't call myself a comedian. Okay. Uh, I call myself a content cartel, okay. because that's a mashup of everything I do. Okay, yeah. content cartel. Yeah. Were you inspired by um, Miguna? You know, he loves that word, cartel. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, actually, I was not inspired by Miguna. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, tell me about the content that you do create. Uh, currently, uh, I do vines, uh, these uh, funny videos, and uh, also I've done uh, longer clips. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, done uh, a movie oh. that was uh, much longer than the normal vines. Okay. Yeah, basically, that's what I'm doing currently. Do your professors know that you do this? Professors? Uh -huh. <laughs> I think I think some of them have, uh, have met me. Though if you meet me in person and you see the person in the video, right. you don't actually look you, the same. You can't put them together. Yeah. Okay. What about your friends and your family? Uh, my friends and my family. Actually, no. Yeah, the person seated here is a uh, crazy can. I tell you the crazy can is a much larger group. Okay. Okay. Uh, my friends and uh, family, my father knows, my, my, all my parents know. Okay. They do watch my videos. Okay. And sometimes uh, my father will come and uh, look at a video and call me and ask me, hey, uh, what were you trying to mean here? <laughs> so they are keen followers. Of that's good. Work. That's really good. That's a blessing. Yeah. Um, tell me then about the inspiration behind your jokes and, and the things you do. What do you usually create content about? I create content about most everything let me say everything anywhere i can get inspiration there's some inspiration i'm getting oh Lord. from around why am uh, i scared uh, tv presenters oh be Lord. like you see <laughs> <laughs> am i gonna end up on a vine yeah you might end up on oh, a vine. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh no <laughs> so my inspiration is uh, is always everywhere anything around me stories i listen to experiences uh, music the songs i listen to because yeah. i do musical vines yeah. i do normal jokes i do anything that people relate with okay yeah no liko mtukutu when you were growing up no 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 i don't are have you any the last born? no i'm not the last one are you sure I mean, not sure, but are you lying? <laughs> <laughs> Oops, that question can lead into a whole different... <laughs> no, I'm not, I'm not, I'm no, not you're not the last one. Yeah. Okay. And you were not naughty when you were growing up? No, I was not naughty. I don't have any traces of be, being naughty. <laughs> I, was a very, I, was a, I was a good person, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, how is it then balancing being a student? You know, actuarial science is not an easy subject. Yeah. Um, how is it balancing that now with, with comedy? That's why I'm the content cartel. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> no, but balancing uh, uh, sometimes, you know, there are times for creating jokes. Like uh, currently, we are on a period of uh, COVID 19. Mm -hmm. So most of the learning is not going on. So we are taking advantage of this period. Mm. When in school, we do learning. Yeah. And uh, when at, uh, at home, sometimes when I'm at my place, I do content creation. So okay. balancing uh, is not that. Uh, difficult okay yeah well we have some of his clips actually running on air unfortunately we won't have the audio uh for you but maybe you can just explain what was what was this this particular is it a vine vine yeah mm. what was that one about 
the one I've seen. Mm. Uh, that one was uh, on uh, 10 ways on how to avoid paying rent during this quarantine. Uh -huh. In fact, I've seen that article somewhere on the internet. Please, to LSA is the tip Zako, but 10 ways to avoid paying rent during quarantine. Uh, unajua, kuna vile landlord akiingia, mm. kuna vile unaeza, unaeza mdisahamu. Akiingia tu hivyo, unajua naingianga na tempa kama umekawa kulipa rent. Mm -hmm. So, una, unamchapia jokes, kwanza moja mbili, kwanza, kubring mm -hmm. out the environment, ndia si? Uh, sao, sao. Okay. Akijaribu kuongea una, una make sure wajataja story ya rent. Akienda kusema na nikuwa nataka kulipa. Ah, oh, landlord, tulia kwanza, tulia kwanza kunywa kitu. Kisema story ya rent. Landlord, tulia. Unawa na saa hivyo <laughs> ndiyo una counteract iso vitu ya najaribu kusema. Is this a tried and tested method? Have you, have you tried that? Has it worked? <laughs> we need scientific proof. <laughs> Maybe you can try it out. <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oi, okay, okay. Um, from those, what are some? Maybe give us one more, one other point as far as how to uh, how to avoid this paying rent. But ali akumambi o mem sa o mempe akinuaji afanya ni nitena. Eh, si ana kunywa. As in, ni kama una delay your process. By the time atakuwa na itisha rent, itakuwa ni kama na feel guilt. You know, oh. ame kujia kwa kome mchekesha, ame kunywa chai. chai. Um, umesikiza shida zake unaona sasa itakuwa ni kama ana unamfanyia favor kumpatia rent unaona eh. akasema lakini naelewa nitarudi next time jaribu unaona kitu kama hiyo okay yeah. what are some of the big successes i guess you've had or what are some of the jokes of course this one i'm sure really resonated with a lot of kenyans yeah. um what are some of the other ones that have really resonated with your audience a lot of jokes mm -hmm. let me see i what did your uh, favorite ones even yeah, my favorite one. That's the one I did uh, for musical vines where I used uh, the Kenyan songs. Mm -hmm. That one got over 1.1 million views on wow. YouTube. Wow. That one was for promoting, and I like promoting Kenyan music and uh, the Kenyan culture. Yeah. Large. There's uh, the ones for school. Kuna in mfanya recent yenye insha. Kipua insha watu wakona ndika tu gafla binvu. Story, kwe story mama mekuja nyumbani gafla binvu. Wezi wakaingia. <laughs> and uh, yeah, you know, it's my among the favorite that you may find. Okay. Yeah. Um. So, do you see yourself doing this for a long time? Yeah. So we see ourselves doing this. We. We. Because you told say you it's crazy the crazy Kenya is a single person, but tales of the crazy Kenya is a group. So tell us about tales of the crazy Kenya. Tales of the crazy Kenya basically is made up of uh, several member six that people know okay. and others. So you're like the founder. Yeah, the founder of Are Tales these people of the like you sort of coached or trained into this or no, they were also funny? Yeah, no. Uh, we we actually started as uh, two people. I had my friend Stanley Omondi. Okay. To high school at the same time. So we started doing our jokes uh, pole pole. We met another person called uh, Yvonne. Mm -hmm. uh, then we continued m and uh, met uh, Bushra, she. So from there, it was not actually like coaching. You know, I started doing drama a long time ago. So the, when I joined campus, the, I took that opportunity as uh, because I saw there was no drama club. Mm. I decided, let me just start something of my own. Okay. That's when I started picking people and we formed uh, a team. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, <laughs> uh, talk to me about the life of a student. What are some of the things <laughs> that really stand out to you about Kenyan students? <laughs> yeah, so, so, I know you guys student, have yeah? a lot of things to say about guys for, you know, University of Nairobi, nini, nini. But talk to us about the life of a student. Primary, campus, summer, high school. <laughs> yes, a student a, which one do you want to talk about? I just say me kama campus. Yeah, the life of a student, uh, basically, it's sometimes interesting. Okay. Uh, kuna ma time the lecturer does come through class. Ana ulizia, ana kuja tu hivi, unasikia mepea na assignment. Na unajua campus sa zingine, wanyafanya ma assignment, inakunga tricky. But uh, kuna lot of interaction. Campus kuna lot of interaction. You meet new people. Uh. So campus is basically interesting. Yeah. I think so. I think it's, yeah, it's very interesting. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So how how is it um, in this season of, of COVID? Of course, y y I don't know, maybe you weren't doing live shows just yet. Were you planning on doing that? Have you at all been affected? You seem to have been very digital to begin with. So During this period of COVID, as uh, you know, as Tales of the Crazy, you know, we also have a movement called the Live Vine Show. 
Okay. Basically, he does live vines on stage. We did one show last year. Mm -hmm. So currently, we are uh, doing a fight against depression. You know, during this period, a lot of people are depressed. One yeah. of the people that attended uh, our shows actually passed because of uh, depression. Oh, so no. we are pushing an agenda to stop uh, the fight against uh, depression by entertaining people, educating people, tackling some of the issues like uh, heartbreaks, mm. uh, loss of uh, job. Mm -hmm. So our content currently is pushing about uh, real life situation that causes, uh, causes people to go to depression. You know, yeah. that's what we are tackling currently during this period. Well done. Yeah. That's, a, that's a very good way to use your platform. Yeah. And um, I guess sort of related to the same for the many young people, like I guess what's your particular, of course you have these different themes, but what are some of the things that you'd really say to young people struggling during this time? Kuna watu walikuwa wanafaa wakua mesha graduate at this point, walikuwa nangoja tuseme internship, ama labda ata kazi walikuwa mepata, now you know they're just sitting at home or you know they've been stranded someplace. What would you say? You know, this is, uh, I want first to say that uh, this is something new that has never occurred. Mm -hmm. So, uh, my first advice I will say that, you know, everything that has a beginning must have an end. Mm -hmm. And we must learn to adapt. You know, during this period, there we have a lot of negativities. So, what I encourage people to do is just to look for something positive during this period. Mm -hmm. As long as you, you are breathing, you're still alive, you're not dead, you're not, uh, you don't have that disease. You have something to thank God about. Sure. So that's one thing. Another thing, uh, let's be there for one another. You know, a story shared uh, might also help. If I am depressed and I don't talk about it, I might end up committing suicide. Mm -hmm. So listening to other people, listening to their stories and sharing them, that's one thing, uh, other thing somebody should do. Yeah. 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 And you know what, we talk a lot about youth and... Uh, I guess political involvement in this show, governance and leadership in this country. Uh, do you see yourself having a voice now? I mean, because you've amassed quite the audience uh, with, with your platforms. Um, do you see yourself having a voice sort of in really trying to encourage young people to step, out to the, step up to the plate as far as leadership and governance is concerned? Do you see answer to the same stories that we always no, no. find ourselves being used for political agendas and yet the youth are the majority in this country and they'll always continue to suffer? Do you see yourself having a role there? That's a, uh, we are still of the crazy can actually are part, uh, partaking in that uh, role by mm -hmm. uh, educating our our followers and our fans on uh, how to handle some of the issues, the, what I told you previously. Mm. So we are even if we have uh, meetings, we meet our fans. We actually tell them that uh, we actually pass these messages that uh, people should not get involved in some of the political activities in a negative way mm -hmm. but they should use everybody has an influence even a person who doesn't have followers everybody has an influence sure. so if you educate one person one person will go and educate the other mm -hmm. and we'll have a mass of people that are well educated mm -hmm. yeah mm -hmm. wow someone here says sister miki to just say hi to crazy kenna hi. and keep up with the show uh agnes says crazy kenna he's so funny ache handle your youtube um and you're greeting george kimani watching in nakuru yes for sure, people need to be able to go and watch your content. How do they find you? Okay. We are found at uh, Tales of the Crazy Kenna on Instagram, YouTube, <laughs> Facebook, and Twitter. <laughs> Tales of the Crazy Kenna. Oh, you can just say Crazy Kenna. I'm the only Crazy Kenna in the country. Do you hear how your jaloness comes out when you say Twitter? Yeah, tweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's when I'm, I'm on character. <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> I love you, Mr. Mati. As we close, you may say, "Okay, here, Pastor Sati, Sujuna, you may want a view to, you may part inspiration your content creation around GTV presenting, blah blah blah." Kionja, too. I need to be prepared for if you if you are going to create. I just need to be prepared for. I I must use the element of surprise. Oh Lord, I don't like this idea. I don't like this at all. Thank you very much for coming onto the show. It's been a pleasure talking to you. Me too. And I wish you tremendous success as you continue with this, especially where you use your platform for good. Asante san. Aya, barikyo. Okay, guys, we're going to take a break now. 
Um, but coming up next, we still have a book review. We're going to be talking about how to upgrade your lives, okay? That's coming up next. And, of course, we'll be sharing some more of your SMSs. If you'd like a chance to win some masks, please do get SMSing in to 22999. I'll be back shortly.